Okay, Ruby, bye, 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 bye. And thank you very much. Gosh, she knew so much about that. So knowledgeable. Bats. Yeah, great. Incredible. Nine year old bat girl, Ruby. <laughs> Lovely to see her. Right, on to the weather. Uh, wintry? Yes, as we head towards the weekend, Julie Smith photographed this great sunrise in Weymouth this morning. Thank you. John Craigie took this picture of the morning sunshine at Avon Beach in Mudderford. So we had plenty of sunshine today, but other areas had some cloud. And overnight tonight, the cloud will increase rapidly and we're expecting some really quite heavy thundery downpours. Not only that, a weather warning from the Met Office for strong winds. Now, along coastal stretches, we may have wind gusts of 60 to 70 miles per hour, inland wind gusts of 40 to 50 miles per hour, coupled with this heavy rain, thundery rain with some hail. The rain will eventually clear most places by dawn. We will have a few clear spells and temperatures will be fairly mild overnight tonight lows of 7 to 11 celsius so it may well be quite a damp start for the southeastern corner of the country tomorrow morning the odd isolated shower tomorrow but tomorrow's well more in the way of sunshine than today and as a result temperatures will reach a high of 11 to 13 celsius so a lovely day in store bar one or two very isolated showers now tomorrow night we're expecting further rain could be heavy in places, not as heavy as tonight, but it will skirt the south coast, moving its way eastwards. Parts of Oxfordshire and Buckinghamshire could stay dry altogether. And tomorrow night, it will feel a little bit cooler. And slowly but surely, temperatures are ta taking a slide as we head towards the weekend. So through the course of Friday, it will feel fresher, a high of 11 or 12 Celsius. The chance we could have some patchy rain, particularly through the latter part of the afternoon into the evening, overnight into Saturday morning. There could be some patchy rain, won't, not amounting to too much there will be some drier periods as well and low pressures in charge of our weather. So as we look ahead to the rest of the week, Thursday we will see some sunny spells. Tomorrow the risk of the odd shower as well. Patchy rain on Friday for some. Some drier periods but a lot more cloud than recent days. And for the weekend it will feel bitterly cold with one or two scattered showers. And those showers could potentially on Saturday be wintry in nature. So a mixture of hail, sleet and even the odd snow shower. But at the moment, there is uncertainty as to who will be affected by those showers. They will be hit and miss, but it will feel bitterly cold and you'll need those extra layers. Sally? I shouldn't say the word, should I? Snow. I know, I know. Possibility next week as well. Oh, right, OK. Uh, that's it from us this evening. More at uh, 8 and 10.30. Join us tomorrow, half past six if you can. Thanks for watching this evening. Bye-bye. Good night.